More rolling waste carts will replace blue boxes and auto bins across Winnipeg under a trash management plan aimed at dramatically boosting recycling. And to cover the costs of the changes, slated to begin next year, the city will charge every household a $50 annual fee. It's part of a strategy to increase Winnipeg's landfill diversion from the current 15%, lowest among major Canadian cities, to 50% or more. Despite controversy over the flat fee tacked onto water bills, Mayor Sam Cates says it amounts to 13.5 cents per day and is the right way to go. Have you ever heard of any initiative that's taken by a city that's going to cost people money and they go celebrate and dance in the streets? That's not the case. So as I said, you're never going to make everybody happy. The bottom line in this situation, you need to do what's best for the city. The plan is to more than double the waste diversion to 35% within five years, partly by providing residents with 240 liter rolling recycling carts, including in areas served for years by back lane bins. Mike Pactican of the Point Douglas Ward likes the carts, but not the $50 fee, and is one of four councillors who voted against the strategy. This new rollout cart system has been proven to work. It, I've seen it work myself firsthand, uh, and, I, and I'm confident it'll work going forward. So it, it is a good thing. It is a good thing. The fee just isn't a good thing. The city will also begin collecting yard waste from curbsides and spend more than $13 million to create depots for electronic waste, larger trash items, and hazardous materials. One of the plan's components is construction of a $20 million recycling facility. Ross Romanuk, Winnipeg Sun.